It, this show <laughs> continues to exceed expectations. <laughs> This, is, this one was actually really... like, I mean, this is a total Brian show, so I can see. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude! You got fighting on more fighting on top of fighting, dude. It's great. <laughs> but I still enjoy it too, even for all the fighting it does. Yeah. Taylor, your uh, your this episode was so awesome. <laughs> like this was all about the girls. Navarro was so freaking cool. <laughs> the animation was beautiful. We got to learn yep. more about the sisters and their complicated relationship with each other. Like. This episode was so great. This is easily my favorite episode of like the second portion. Oh. I really enjoyed. Um, so this episode really made me enjoy uh, Maki as a character. But I don't really know about did. Mai. Like, like I feel like we're trying hard to like to make us empathize with her, but it's like I, I, can't, I can't care. So yeah. Much. After this, I just I still don't care for Mai. Like I said, it was Maki 100. <laughs> percent yeah. She showed that she is such a badass, and this person just has guns or a gun. The water animation was nuts. I, actually, the, the the animation just in general, everything about. Hope you enjoy was, your Kill Bill in this episode. This is Mappa. This is Mappa, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. This is this. Just the brilliance of it. That's uh, they the the one thing I was actually not. They went through a lot of fights too, but I'm assuming because this is the episode where they kind of budgeted for fights. I, I assume they just try to pack really whatever they could with just kind of giving us like, a enough lot, of like back, so right? much animation budget being that thrown at lot. this episode. Uh, that was basically from like mm -hmm. beginning to end. Even like the just like the normal shots like they, when they were just talking like like it, you could just tell like it was like a step up from like their normal just mm -hmm. definitely Dude, it's like, shot. They're doing this along with like AOT like and mm -hmm. um I don't think they're I think what I think these are two main shows but I know that they got work on Chainsaw Man too so it's like Stepping it up, yeah, <laughs> they're all over everything, and people are sending them death threats. And stuff. Yeah, I know <laughs> they have so many different things going on, though. But it, no, like this, like episode, uh, it was who else? Like, what were the other fights? It was it mainly just Maki uh, and Mai, and then um, oh, the witch girl, yeah. and oh, actually, no, no, well, and, the, uh, game, the game was Maki and the blue hair chick, I think. Yeah, <laughs> was it Miki? If I her name, <laughs> Momo, Momo, Momo. okay, Momo, yeah. and then 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 it was um. And then it was, uh, I think, Noboru and uh, Nobara and um, the witch. My. Oh. Well, the witch no, girl. Nomura. Yeah. Nobara and the, yeah. the witch girl. Oh, and yeah, then, yeah. then it was mm -hmm. um, Mai and Maki. The, the witch is a terrible character. I don't know why. I just can't stand this. Like, the, like, she just looks ridiculous. Well, uh, everything she goes, she, right now, she's, she, she's just a support to Mai. We don't really know much about her. That's why. She's, like, she's like the, uh, she's like the, was it the, the, the the vision for like the team, basically, she has hey, like some yeah, you, you ate reconnaissance and all that stuff. Vision is, sir. Don't be, <laughs> right? If you, if you don't have those call outs, you're getting shot from your, you know, yeah. your rear end. Like seeing, like seeing some of her like strength and abilities, you know, it's a nice that she like stepped it up from what we first saw her with her. Uh, I wanted to see more of what happened with the hammer though. The second shot, I wanted to see what happened with the squeaky toy. Oh yeah, she's running. Uh, they they slow mo <laughs> yeah. out of her. Yeah, we're just like, no, nah, I can't, I can't hear it with the other hammer. Like, let's try this one. Like she hit it once, but then that second shot didn't hit uh, or uh, connect. I, I wanted to see. Wait, like, you talking about the squeaky hammer? The squeaky hammer. Yeah, <laughs> because it felt like it was like the first hit. Like like something else had to happen with that second hit for it because it seemed like the first con like it hit with contact like didn't really do anything. But then you know she was gonna swing again, but then you know she got hit by a, a rubber bullet. Oh, the bullet. Yeah. 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 And it ruined it off for us. I mean, it was oh, still a big man. shot. Yeah, it, was a, because it was a good cut to focus yeah. on a, you know the other fight then. Yeah, yeah, so. I mean, but that, that whole kind of animation with the like, she definitely kind of stepped it up from when we first saw her with like just like a few nails and then like the, the oh the, yeah, oh, you talking about like the, the first encounter with the yeah, the, the where curse. I'm just, yeah, because when I first saw, it, I was like, where the hell is this power going to go? Yeah, I know. Now basically they dumped all the animation budget. They're like, watch this, <laughs> yeah. flying through the trees and everything. <laughs> throw a bunch of nails everywhere, and then they explode too. No, and plus the uh, all she like uh. Um, even just like I like, still wanted to just see that second, just that second shot <laughs> connect, because you knew something epic was going to happen. I uh, know I was satisfied with this episode, so I didn't either. Oh no, I still, yeah. yeah, I still got nothing, <laughs> nothing bad to, to say about this. But that's really all this episode was was just like slight backstory. Yeah, just like, fight, 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 and there's Mafia favorite. in my backstory. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah dude, it, yeah, it was, it was, uh, it was, it was awesome. Do we think though? Is it going to keep up with the same kind of like uh, animation and because this is basically like going to be like the you know fighting for like the next few episodes? Because I'm just wondering if like if the rest of the season just this tournament because we still haven't done like any of the yokai like extermination. Yeah, I Japan think it now. would be because you figure we have um, Fushiguro and the Neji 
clone guy who we don't know how his eyes work but i think in the preview they show his eyes finally open and they oh, have like yeah. red so still, around it so their fight or like yeah so we have we have their fight and then i guess that'll be everybody then right from both the, the kyoto and the tokyo side uh, or like oh, no, we, don't the, no. we don't have the speaking guy yeah. either i want to see that that's like my next like hype moment i want to see this man like, and I, then we're gonna get the curse crew back into the mix yeah hmm. That's like, like probably the, the climax of this season. Like my previous things that I've kind of like uh, where like things where I've complained about like just like OP characters, but for some reason I've always like characters with like those speaking abilities because it just makes them like really? it just makes them because yeah, it just feels like epic. It, it, where it's just like just like the like the, the was it like the weight of words just like uh where it just like affects them. It's uh it kind of reminds me of like that uh was it zombie deska where basically like she like just her words basically just just oh, would destroy the main chick oh yeah, yeah. yeah like where she be, where it's just like she couldn't speak because it basically like nobody could handle it like that I don't know why I've always just thought those moments or those type of like those abilities are just they're awesome hmm. I don't know why yeah like when he um, first like, well, like when he first like spoke when he said like don't move and then like it just made it seem so epic I thought that was really cool but that's just my thing yeah they're definitely putting a lot of impact on that guy's ability so hopefully it, it pays off well yeah, I mean, they, well, say, they say too yeah. like you can counter it if you just put your curse yeah. guard your yeah ears, right and your ears, yeah so. yeah they, it, or basically they have to have that like focus there all the time just like him being like somewhere in the area that they could just they made it sound like like they just have to be ready for him yeah yep um, that's how, that's how we also got the the introduction to that other chick who uh, was sitting with like the principals and stuff. Mm -hmm. I can't remember her name for the life of me, but all, oh, all right. that money. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The girl who's just like, I get run by money and I do everything by money. Oh, God, <laughs> capitalism, bro. <laughs> and Goto's just like, okay. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. There Some, was it. Um. Yeah, no, like uh, I still what those like those main main fights. I mean, we still have uh Yuji happening as well that we haven't seen uh We saw a lot of yeah. with him and, and and Toto. They got so. they yeah. got like two and a half episodes. Yeah, but stuff, you know so. like when the like when the main kind of like fight happens, you you would assume that the like, animation would be stepped up as well. Yeah. I mean, it'll definitely come back when the the cursed tree guy arrives. Yeah, it'll be kind of like one of the, the last few things. I'm sure. Uh, but yeah. I no, it's I definitely know. definitely interesting to see Mappa's focus on on this episode in the animation because I feel like Attack on Titan, like the, the animation hasn't been bad, but I definitely don't see the same level of what they're doing with um, like this show Jujutsu Kaisen. Better than Attack on Titan, and that, I would think it would be the opposite almost. Like <laughs> yeah. I know Jujutsu Kaisen has a lot of like love from the fan base and everything is very popular in Shonen Jump right now. But I compare that to like Tech and Titan. So I know. I will, yeah. No. Yeah. So that's why I like. <laughs> I will. I feel. I feel like Gigguk slash Gaunt. Like you know, on YouTube. Like I feel like he actually described it pretty well, where he was saying basically like with Attack on Titan, it's like a ten level story, and it's been a ten level animation up until this point, and now it's down to like a nine. So it's still really, really good. Yeah. Just not quite where it was. And I feel like maybe they were refocusing on Jujutsu Kaisen since that is still a smaller audience. They want to maybe bring more people into it. Like the people who like everybody knows Attack on Titan. They're still giving us like at least eight or nine quality. So, like, yeah, why not put it true. into something new? I mean, it, 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 oh, sorry, go ahead, Justin. I was just going to say, do we know, did MAPPA sign on for uh, Jujutsu Kaisen, like, well before they knew they were ever going to do Attack on Titan? I thought they did sign up for it first, yeah. yeah. I would assume so. So I don't know if that had, like, any effect of it. They're just like, okay, this is what we know we have on the docket, so to speak, so let's put our top-tier animators, like, mm -hmm. on this shit. Yeah, mm -hmm. with the... Um, but also with the Jujutsu anime, though, it, it basically boosted what the manga sales like crazy. Oh, yeah. no, definitely, yeah. It's yeah. <laughs> like it's I did. it's getting to that um because like you know how at least it, I guess here, but it doesn't really matter. But I mean, because before like the big mangas are, are like you know like uh, Hero Academy and even Slayer. Now it's like Tekken Titan or uh, Jujutsu Kaisen starting to get to their levels like really fast. So I like Jujutsu yeah. Kaisen more than Demon Slayer personally. How dare you! Oh, okay. Good thing, okay. good thing Sasha's now, not here. He'd, yeah, now we're <laughs> he'd start doing some power bombs, RKOs out of nowhere. <laughs> no, I, I, I'm not gonna. I, I honestly like. I like them both a lot. Yeah, I'll also say too. That's last thing for just oh, guys saying. Like, I thought like uh, the ending of this episode, paired with the, the ending song, was really nice. Like, I really felt that. So, 
Appreciate. I still, I still hate the ending song. <laughs> I still hate the ending song. I, I appreciate oh, the ending song. Really? Oh, I like the end. I like the ending song. I can appreciate it, but oh, I do not care for the song. The opening is better, but yes. I like the ending song still. <laughs> this is the only Tso Shun Ye song that I've heard that I don't like. The only one. I do not like the ending at all. Ugh. I think I appreciate it over time, so, yeah. No, I just, I just like the it visuals just of the ending. It doesn't fit the theme <laughs> of the show, bro. It, it, it just doesn't. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, that's why I say this episode, though, it was, it was nice. Yeah. I don't know. I still I love the juju strolls after every episode. I don't know about anybody else, but no. that's a, that's a, oh, that's yeah. a high part for me like, as well. Know, They're they, so well done. Are they like are they original? Or are they from the Omakes or for what? I have no, I have no idea. I still don't know. No idea. I was talking about like the ending sequences, like yeah. the cute yeah. little bits. Yeah, yeah. the cute little bits. From the manga. Yeah. Okay, so oh, nice. the Omakes then. Yeah. Sorry, uh, sorry guys. Yeah. Before I forget, I, I've been forgetting this taste like multiple times. Um, you know, at the end of the episodes where they kind of give like the backstory, you know, like the guy that was sitting in the tub. And I think it was Maki this episode. Like, did they actually like retire from being a like a like a jujitsu sorcerer? No, I feel like no. their definition of retired is means like they're not going to lose. Okay, tournament. okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. I was gonna bring that up last oh, yeah. week, it. and I was gonna bring it up a little earlier when we were talking about it, but I forgot it again there. <laughs> so, yeah, no, it's just like they're, they're out of the tournament. Okay, gotcha. Because at the same time, because like how they're like like it, when they're talking about their backstory or their story, it just mm-hmm. sounded like they didn't want to be one in like in general. Like, like Maki basically sounded like, in, in a sense, she felt like she was forced to try. Hi. Because Hi. Mai. Mai. Mai was the one who oh, was sorry, forced to try by Maki's sorry, actions. Maki. Sorry, I got them mixed up. Yeah, well, yeah easy so to do. That, yeah. So, like, that's why like, I kind of got, like, that feeling. And also the guy that was sitting in the tub where he felt like almost there was nothing else for him to do because mm-hmm. what else is he going to do? Mm-hmm. But then they kind of yeah. had that conversation and it, and it made it sound like he was going to be, you know, retiring, not just, like, losing, but he was basically just going to do something else. Oh uh, yeah, I, no. I, I don't know. I just kind of yeah, so, no. that, that makes sense though too. But I was just wanting to kind of clarify and just uh, what you guys' thoughts on that was. But okay, but no, that's the only thing that I wanted <laughs> I, to get up before I wanna, get... like watch like clips of this episode again, just see all the animations. So oh yeah, yeah just kinda, it's beautiful. Like just bookmark that and go back to it later. <laughs> and honestly, I was thinking of Demon Slayer when I was watching it. Like it felt very similar, just with the water and everything. I'm just like, I, all right, yeah, all that's, what I, the that's water. what I told Threaten when this was over. I was like, I haven't felt that way since episode 19 of Demon Slayer. <laughs> Also, like reading the manga for this part, I had no idea that animation was going to be this good. Like, this was not that epic reading it in the manga. So they like stepped it yeah, up that, just that, for the. This film. is what you always hope for in an anime adaptation. Instead of like feeling like, mm-hmm. like you're missing stuff in the manga, you want like to be upgraded because of the animation. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you get, you get Mappa, you get that. You get JC staff, uh, debatable. <laughs> you you oh, roll the oh dice, God. Hey, just, and the dice <laughs> might be uh, loaded. Everyone was so like they're so like cautious about Mappa just because right before Tech and Titan, just because like. The guy of high school and stuff, so dude, God of, God of High School still looked awesome, just the yeah. story was executed poorly. Yeah, <laughs> so. I, I can, he can only take you so far, sir. Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> but the uh, next show that we're gonna be talking about had some sweet scenes as well. <laughs> <laughs> you can say? Yes, so we're gonna end it here for Jujutsu Kaisen.